Hello, my name is Ming Hang. I study at Chiang Prime School. Today, I will talk about gender periodics. So, what is gender periodics? Gender periodics is a form of discrimination for or against one gender, especially in a way considered unfair. Personally, I will talk about gender periodics in the past. A long time ago, in some countries which were controlled and dominated by other countries like Vietnam, South Africa, and India, people believed that men have more important roles than women. They respect the men and respect the women. At the time, men could go to school and take them for that exam, have a bar career path, and also could marry as many wives as they want. However, women had to stay at home and do housework and get married early. Of course, they weren't allowed to go to schools. In addition, a problem that arose at the time is family violence. In India, when girls were 12 or 13 years old, they had to get married and have a lot of babies. If they were not able to give birth, they would be scouted by outsider and beaten by their husband. It observed to see that at the time, women have to live a more boring life than men. Regarding the outward in the world, other women had made great contribution to the world's scientific achievement. Their names still removed from the list of nominees for the award. According to research by Harvard, in societies and organizations that belong gender equalities, Western Europe, North America, permanent figures in societies, scientists, leaders, generate spurmaster, were mainly men. Women still just accounted for a low percentage of leaders in societies. Secondly, let's talk about gender politics nowadays. Men and women share equal roles in societies. Today, men can do all the things they want as men do. Women have the right to go to school, to get married to the person they love. No one can force them to get married and have children when they're 12, 13 years old. Because the law and society today are protecting them, especially. Are going to be non sauce women over or equals to 18 years old are able to get married and if the husband be the wife, they will be punished by the government. Moreover, the role of women in the family has also changed. However, it is no longer the work of only women. Today, both men and women do housework, raise children, and share the financial burn together. One more thing is that today women have also been empowered to hold important positions in societies, as well as being recognized in national award for their contributions. For example, on 12 January 2021, May Harris became Vice President of the United States. Another example is Ms. Michael Lian, CEO of Vietnam Daily Products joint stock companies, Vietnam Milk, had become the only Vietnamese woman to have been a work three times by Forbes magazine, the world leading magazine of America specialized in voting famous and Invodia figures in the world. In my opinion, men and women share equal roles and have the same right. We can do all the things as men, or even better than men. Don't respect men and despise women. Let's see that women are equal to men. Thank you for listening, and I hope you may learn something from my presentations.